In 2015, what I was observing was a major shift. Cloud had been around, but you were finally starting to see the large enterprises deploying uh, a lot of workloads in, uh, in the public cloud environments. There were some people that were excited, and there were some people who were scared. Kubernetes was becoming one of the most talked about container management deployment solutions. People were definitely falling in love with containers and the sort of experience of using containers. We asked ourselves, you know, well, maybe the time is right to create a product that can make all of these problems go away. It became clear to me that we would need a new way, a new way of developing software, uh, of designing software, but also deploying at scale. My product actually was pretty ambitious in what we were trying to accomplish. They want to build a full CI CD system, DevOps platform on top of the public cloud. Basically a one-stop shop for all your um, service needs. Their tagline was to make Kubernetes boring for enterprises. We had to create you know, features that normally would take in the big company like months, and at Aplatics it would be like, let's do it by next Wednesday, and then we do it. <laughs> There was a lot of apprehension. There was a lot of distrust. So it was like a cool tech demo, but I didn't think it was going to be world changing at the time. That's where we hit on the idea of uh, basically taking our workflow engine and make it a standalone component that any developer could very easily try and use. So I talked with Alexander, is this something we can do? Two days later, he had a working prototype. <laughs> During that time period, the need to solve software problems in a programmatic way got even more intense. What ends up happening is like, okay, now we need to operate at a much larger scale. We need a little bit more maturity about our deployment process. We need a workflow engine. We need to be able to do canary deployments, et cetera. And Argo essentially is the perfect solution. Everyone is talking about Argo. The project was just coming alive. Suddenly you had a tool that looked very much like the tool that I always wish I had. Wow.